What you're gonna do is this, the rest is basically all computer signed. So I'm gonna switch over to there, and when we're done, I'll switch back over. So I guess it'll give me a minute. Oh, guys, I'm back. Uh, the rest isn't that hard. Basically, what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna come over here on your. If this depends on your OS, but if you're on Windows 7, you'll come over here. You should see something like this. Click it. This works on a laptop too. Just follow the steps, vice versa. You're gonna click on Open Network and Sharing Center. Wait for that to load. Um, come to adapter settings. Sir, actually, you're gonna create a new dial-up connection. So click on set up a new connection or network. Um, set up a new dial-up connection. Now, with all Samsung phones and mostly AT&T. The dial number is going to be star 99 pound, and that's double dial any Samsung phone. Now, depending on the service you use, you don't have to uh, f f usually fill these out. But since I'm using AT&T's uh, 3G network, I don't have to fill these out. The phone does the rest. It uh, does everything for you. So what you want to do now is click connect. And it does all this. This is going to take a minute. And usually by now it's actually already connected to the internet, but it this sits at the screen for a while, so I'm just going to wait for it to go away so I can confirm it. testing my internet connection this is a uh, very boring yeah and click browse the internet and congratulations this is actually going slower than ah that did not work out how I wanted to it will see it never it's never done that for me before so um just come back here. This is the one I've already created once. I think it's because I have two. I'm not sure. I should delete the first one. You're going to click connect again and just basically reconnect. Wait a couple of seconds and there you go. You have in and out your, with your 3G phone. Now the speeds are slightly good. Um, I can test it, but I don't want to. You can download at about 400 kbs per yeah, get about 400 kbs, and the maximum speed I've got up to is about 1.2 mbs for a download, but it's really rare. Now, the things you don't have to worry about is your bill going up, because if you have the, the uh, AT&T's unlimited plan, everything should be covered, and you don't have to worry about bandwidth and all that stuff. It, it, you, your bill won't go up, and if it does, it'll only be about a small amount, probably a few dollars. So... That's today's video, and um, hopefully Misty uploads hers tomorrow. If there will be another video on my day where I'll be explaining more in depth how to get the 3G phone to work to uh, hook up your Xbox Live. So, 
I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like it, thumbs up it, and leave a comment down below. Um, my name's Andrew, and thanks for watching.